Hey everybody, welcome and welcome back to Diamond Painting Lisa. Thank you for joining me today and I hope you are all doing okay. Today's video is a video of my diamond painting stash. Um, I mean, it's not like some of the stashes I've seen on YouTube where people have got literally over a thousand kits in their stash and things like that. Mine is nothing like that, but I do have quite a few to show you. So I'm going to start off with the um, budget kits which I've only actually got um, five of anyway, so they they won't take me long. So just to get through those. And then most, most of my kits are from Diamond Art Studio UK. And then I've also got a couple of Diamond Art Club and I've also got three Dreamer Designs. So please stay with me and um, go through my stash with me. So, as I say, first of all, budget kits. These are either Fansaws, eBay, something like that. Um, they're just little kits, really, sort of what I would class as snack size kits. That one is a... 30 by 40 and as you can see is very dark so yeah it's not I mean the drill feels not too bad to be fair but this is probably one I would take um, when we go on holiday and we're staying in a caravan I would probably take this one with me just to complete while I'm you know sort of if we have a night in or whatever I would probably complete that one and the next one is again I think is a Fansels one and this one again is a small one a little snack size one and is, yeah, basically a very budget diamond painting. That's the drills. Toolkit there, basic toolkit. So yeah, that's that one. Next one, again, I think is Fancels. Um, this one is a 30 by 40. There's a little wolf looking at himself in a reflection sees himself as a big wolf but yeah that's a little 35 14 again would be one I'd probably take on holiday although I think my eyes might struggle with those all those dark colors on that one but yeah that's that one and the next one is again I believe Fransels and it's just a it's basically a picture of the moon again it's a 30 by 40 and I've, I've had these Fancels ones in my stash from like the beginning of lockdown when I first started diamond painting and I still haven't done them, um, you know, since I bought the likes of um, Diamond Art Studio. I've not really sort of gone back to my Fancels ones, but I will. I mean, the drill, you know, as I say, the drill field's nice and clear and I know Fancels are very popular. So, you know, and it, at least it is a poured glue kit. So, yeah, and it is nice and sticky. So there's no no worries there. Actually, that does look like double-sided, but usually when they're in this cellophane, they're poor glue. But yeah, again, I would take that one on holiday with me and I'd complete it while sitting in the caravan and relaxing. But yeah, it's just a little snack size one, so ideal to take away. And the next one is... I'm not going to unravel this one because by the looks of this paper on it, it's a double sided, so I'm not going to pull that one back, but that one's basically what the kit looks like. And again, is just a, a budget one I bought off a D stash company. The next one is this kit is actually from Prism Diamond Painting. They're a UK company. Um, this one is called Love You and it is a 40 by 50. And there are the drills, all nicely bagged. That's great. I love it when the drills are in bags. And yeah, that is a nice quality canvas and is poured glue. So yeah, love that one. That's so cute. So yeah, love that. The next one is actually one I got from a, a page on AliExpress called Manhui Rachel. Um, and a lot of you I know have probably heard of her. She does... I have done a, um, a custom from her before um, of a picture of a fox that one of my friends took a photo of. And to be fair, um, I'll try and put a picture up on the screen, but that did actually look stunning once it was completed. This one is actually a, let's see, what size was this one? Is a 60 by 80 um, and is a picture of my grandson on a seesaw. Um, but... To be honest, I wished I'd edited the photo before I sent it her because I could have chopped the entire of that side off because that's just, it's got nothing on it. He's not even on that side. And she just, when I sent, sent her the picture, I messaged her the next day saying, actually, can I edit that a little bit? And she said, oh, I'm sorry, it's already, it's already in production, but it was literally the following day. But 
you know, whatever. I mean, maybe I could trim it down. I suppose it's worth considering. If it's going in a frame, I could probably get away with that. But yeah, that was, as I say, was at Man Hilly Rachel on AliExpress. Now the next two are a UK company that actually went under. Um, and unfortunately, a lot of people did lose out. Um, these, the next two are customs that I had done by Windsor Diamond Art. Um, and they did go under owing a lot of people money. Um, this is, again, is double-sided. You can see where the tape is coming away there. So, yeah, not a fan of double-sided at all, to be honest. But basically, I asked them for a pic. I wanted a picture of all my three cats together. Um, now, that there was no way that was going to happen because they hate each other. So I said to um, Windsor, you know, is there anything you can do editing it? Because the, I've, I've had these from when I first started diamond painting. I didn't really... I, didn't, I had no clue how to edit myself, so <clears throat> I asked them if they could do anything, and they did actually port. It's not a very good picture, but um, I don't want to, as I say, unravel it, but basically it's my three cats, Lola, Colin, and Blue, and they've kind of put them sitting in flames, I suppose. <laughs> um, but yeah, at least it meant I could have, because I sent them three separate pictures, and they put all three onto one picture for me. So, yeah, I mean, this is quite a large kit. Um, what size is this one? It's a pretty big one. Yeah, it's an 80 by 80. So, yeah, it's quite a big kit. But as I say, it's double sided. So I'm not going to unravel that one. But, yeah, um, I did have a custom before from Windsor. And it wasn't too bad in quality and stuff. It was, you know... The next one again is a Windsor Diamond Art and it's a custom, it's a picture of me and my husband. Again, it's kind of, it's all wrapped up this one is, so I'm not going to undo it because I don't want to cause any damage to the um, canvas. But yeah, that is, that is the image. It's just myself and my husband. It was taken in a pub, so again, they've edited the background for me to take out all the background details behind us that were behind us when the picture was taken. So yeah, and this one's a 90 by 70. So yeah, um, but you know, it's, all the drills are in those little plastic bags that I absolutely hate. But yeah, um, so yeah, that was Windsor Diamond Art. And I know, like I say, a lot of people were owed money when they went under, so not great. But yeah, so now we are on to um, my Diamond Art Studio canvases. So first up we have... Days Field. This one is 32 colours and is a 40 by 50. But yeah, that's a really sweet little kit. I would class this as kind of a snack size kit. But I mean, look how beautiful and clear the drill field is. It's it's lovely. Um, I got this off their clearance section because Diamond Dot Studio are actually selling off all their um, what's classed as a shutterstock image. Um, which basically means anyone can use the image and they are, they will be, um, once all their clearance section is gone, all of their kits will be licensed artist kits. So that's fabulous. Um, so, yeah, because I do like to know that the artist is being paid for their work. So, yeah, that is Daisy Fields. And as I say, is 32 colours. And this is the drills. Ignore the fact that the drills look messy. It's because I've already opened the bag and... Um, done an unboxing video a lot of these kits you will have seen on my unboxing videos if you do watch my videos so I do apologize if you've seen things again but I just thought it'd be nice to just do the entire stash in one go so yeah that's Daisy Field and the next one is World Earth Day how stunning is this this one is a 60 by 60 and it is by one of Diamond Art Studios' many licensed artists, Esda Anna Voros, and also known as Everything You Can Imagine Is Real. As you can see there along the bottom of the canvas, that's on all of Esda's canvases with Diamond Art Studio. But yeah, look at that. How beautiful is that? This one is 40 colours and has an AB in it as well. So... Yeah, there's going to be some added sparkle, even though their drills are such fabulous quality, they sparkle anyway. But yeah, just a bit of extra, extra bling with the AB drills, which is Aurora Borealis. If you're new to um, diamond painting, they just have like a, an iridescent coating on them. 
Sorry, my cat's trying to get into a tiny box that's not even big enough for her head to go in, so I don't know how she thinks she's getting in there. But most of you will probably know about Lola, and that's just how she is. Let me just see if I can find the drills for this one. Yeah. I mean, just look at those beautiful colours. Those are beautiful greens and all the purples and pinks in there. But yeah, there's a lot of green in this one, obviously, because of the background, so... Reds, absolutely lovely, beautiful, beautiful. So yeah, that is World Earth Day. Honestly, it probably took me longer to set up than the video is actually going to take. Show you all these. But thank you for your patience and staying with me. The next one is another Esther, and this one is called. I choose you and everyone went crazy for this one when it first came out but yeah it's absolutely beautiful it's a 60 by 60 and it has 43 colours and one of those is an AB so yeah and it's going to be a lot of your AB is going to be in this bit here but yeah I mean that is just absolutely beautiful isn't it the AB will be in all the stars as well as you can see I don't know if you can see that but yeah all those little stars will all be the ABs as well, so how beautiful is that? Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, and again, as I say, is by the lovely Asda. That's beautiful. Let me show you the drills on that one. So yeah, another, another beautiful pack of drills. Again, as I say, I'll have opened this because I've done an unboxing video, so yeah, look at those gorgeous colours. Absolutely beautiful. Just to say, when I'm showing these canvases, should you notice any marks or creases on the canvas, that will be because I bought them from Diamond Art Studio's Wonky Range. Now, if you're new to Diamond Art Studio, they have a section on their website called the Wonky Range, and that will be where, um, when they looked at the canvases before sending out, they found it could be a tiny little mark on the back of a canvas. Um, it it's so minor, it won't be on the drill field, but they do give you a discount on the kit. So, you know, their wonky um, range is always worth having a look. The next one is the beautiful Gingerbread House. Again, this is one, this was one of their very popular kits. But it's now in the clearance section because it's a shutterstock image. So that one will be going once they sell. If they've not already, they will be gone. But yeah, I'm going to start like from the top for you and just because this one's too big for my dining table <laughs> this one has got 38 colors and this one is a let's have a look a 60 by 90 so yeah there we go look at i mean just those look at those bright yellows and oranges this one's going to be so oh, i have actually seen this one completed as well and it does look absolutely stunning so yeah any of these kits that you're looking at and thinking oh you know i'd like to have a go at that one go and have a look on their page and you'll see if they've still got them in stock first of all if they're clearance ones and you'll be able to see them completed because i can guarantee someone will have done them I and mean, this one has been done quite a few times so yeah but yeah let I me mean, just look at those colors they are just absolutely beautiful lovely pinks and oranges and blues just such a mixture of beautiful sea of colors in there isn't there but it's just lovely so that's Gingerbread House. I don't want to focus on them too much because, um, as I say, I've done unboxing videos and I'd, obviously I also don't want to go too in-depth and lose your interest in the video. Hope you're staying with me. The next one, this is absolutely beautiful, is one of their licensed artists and this one is called Eight of Swords. This is by Moonshape Monday. This one is a 60 by 100 and it has 37 colours and this kit is fully hand chartered. So yeah, a lot, a lot of work has gone into this kit, but just look how beautiful that is. Again, I'm just sliding it up the table because it's not all going to fit in the, in the camera. But yeah, how beautiful is that? And again, I've seen this one completed and it is absolutely stunning, this one is. I really like the border around the outside. I think that really gives it beautiful detail. 
so yeah there, there, there will be some more tarot card ones to come i'm sure um in the new in the in this year sometime i'm pretty sure we'll have some um diamond dot studio do have quite a few new kits going to be coming to us hopefully this year so yeah that is lovely let me show you the drills for that one because again the beautiful bright colors in that one just look at those they're just gorgeous 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 colors lots of oranges and blues and greens and reds they're just absolutely beautiful such a vibrant colored kit this one is absolutely love it let's say that one is by the artist moonshape monday it's such a heavy kit when you've got all the drills in it right put that one to one side and the next one is again Diamond Art Studio and this is, I have to say, this is probably one of my favourites as well. This one is called Sleepwalkers and it's another Esda Anavoras one, which is absolutely gorgeous. This one is a 60 by 90 and it has 29 colours and just look at that. Again, just sliding it up the table so that you can see all of it. Again, I've seen this one completed and it does look absolutely stunning. How gorgeous is that? And again, as this one's got an AB in as well, um, it's over here in this section and it's gonna be dotted about in the stars as well. So yeah, that's gonna look absolutely stunning. And the drills for that one, as you can see, are just absolutely gorgeous. I love those. Look at that colour. Absolutely beautiful colours. Really lovely. So yeah, that is, as I say, Sleepwalkers. Uh, the next one. Oh, this one's such a cutie. This is called Snow Owl. There's another Diamond Dart Studio one. This one is 26 colours. And he's a little nice... 40 by 40, so he's a nice snack size one, but look at his beautiful face. Isn't he gorgeous? Absolutely loving me, such a cutie. I've seen him completed as well, and he does look absolutely lovely. So sweet. Where's his drills? Let's have a look. Yeah, again, I've opened the packet, so please excuse the state of the bag. But yeah, lots of nice blues and white and greys, and he's lovely, isn't he? No owl. And the next one is now this one. Everyone went crazy for this one when it came out. This one is On the Last Day, and this is by Hafsa Idris, and it's just absolutely stunning. This one is 44 colours and it is a 50 by 70, and this one has actually got four ABs in it. So this one has absolutely loads of beautiful sparkle in it. A lot of confetti in this one as well. So yeah, a lot of colour changing over here. And then obviously you do get to do some colour blocking on this bit here and on the figures. But yeah, that's just absolutely gorgeous. I do adore that one. That's on the last day, as I say, it was by Havsa. And just look at those colours in there. Havza is a fabulous artist. She does a lot of her um, paintings. She does them with her fingertips. So she's just an absolutely fantastic artist. And worth going, go and have a look at her on. She's got a YouTube channel and she, she shows, you know, sort of some of her videos where she's doing her paintings and they just they just look amazing. She's just so talented. But yeah, look at those. So yeah, that's on the last day and again as I say I have seen this one completed and it is absolutely beautiful the colour in this one is just you know because those ABs it just looks absolutely fabulous next one here's oh it's another Hadza this one is called Azul A-Z-U-L um, Azul Azul and this one is a 50 by 70 and is 
It's got 44 colours in this one and this one is what I would class as um, pretty confetti heavy. But again, I have seen this one completed and it does look absolutely beautiful. It's just, oh, it's, it really is lovely. This is one of the ones I've watched um, have to do on her, on her YouTube channel, the finger painting, and she's just, she's just amazing. She just really is amazing, but yeah. That's Azul, and let me just show you his drill. I'm saying he, I'm assuming is a he. And just look at those absolutely beautiful colours in there. Just look at that. Beautiful colours. So yeah, that's that one. And the next one is... Pink Blossom Tree. This one is um, another Esther. And this one has got 39 colours, one of which is an AB. And this kit is a 50 by 50. But yeah, just look at that. That is so beautiful. Really gorgeous. Your ABs are going to be in here and along the tops of the tree, along the tops of the blossom tree. That is really pretty. Absolutely love that. And that... With the drills for pink blossom tree as you can see lots of beautiful god knows how many different shades of pink in there and some greys and yeah that's just absolutely gorgeous gorgeous colours yeah that is that one the next one is one I picked up off um, Diamond Art Studios clearance section because it's a shutterstock one which they are clearing out all their shutter stock so they can move to licensed artists only. So yeah, this one is a 50 by 60. It's called Zen Calm and this one has 35 colours. Again, I've seen this one completed as well. So, um, I mean, Diamond Dots do are great. When people complete their kits, they do post them on their page. So it's nice to see, you know, what the kit will actually look like when you complete it. So that's fabulous. But yeah, that's Zen Calm and that... Here's the drills for that one. So yeah, some look at those beautiful colours in there. Yellows and greens and pinks, reds, just a bit of everything in there. That is just lovely. So that's Zen Khan. The next one is a very bright one. Um, again, was picked up out of Diamond Art Studios clearance section. And this one is called Rainbow Sunflower, as you can see. Is very very pretty very pretty indeed some good color blocking in this one so yeah sh shouldn't take too huge a time 32 colors and 50 by 50 so yeah that's rainbow sunflower and there's the beautiful rainbow of colors for that one which are absolutely lovely I got this one in round actually because I do like to do round now and again just for a bit of a change to break it up from doing squares. So I do squares mainly. Most of my um, stash is square, but I do like to have a bit of variety as well. The next one, which is the last Diamond Art Studio one, is called Rose Reflection. And again, this is one I picked up off their um, clearance section. Oh no, I didn't actually know. This, this one, the kids got me for Mother's Day last year, I think, so yeah. Rose Reflection and this one is 33 colours and it is a 50 by 65. So yeah, very pretty. Very, very pretty. Beautiful, nice, clear canvases from Diamond Art Studio as well. But yeah, I mean, look, very pretty colours in there. They just, they're just beautiful, aren't they? Really beautiful. So yeah, that's Rose Reflection, and that is the end of my Diamond Art Studio kits. The next one is a Dreamer Designs kit, um, and this one is called Confetti the Cat. But yeah, I mean, it's it always shocks me when I see like how different other companies' canvases look, because this one looks just like the you know the schematic down the side just looks completely different to. Diamond Art Studios and yeah but that one 28 colours um, a couple of ABs in there 
I got this one on a um, D stash page actually, this one, Confetti the Cat. But yeah, it's a nice little 40 by 50, so it's not a not a huge painting. But um, those are the drills. This is how Dreamer Designs drills come. They come in those um, packets that you need to cut open and fit up with. I do prefer drills that come in bags, but not every company does that. But that, that's my preference personally. But you know, Dreamer Designs do have fabulous quality kits and the drills are fabulous quality. So I will kit up in pots anyway for that one. So yeah, that is Confetti the Cat from Dreamer Designs. Next one is another Dreamer Designs kit. And this one is called Summertime Mill. And this is quite a big one, so I will kind of slide this one around for you. This one is a 80 by 60 and has 66 colours and there's one AB in there. Oh no, sorry, there isn't. I tell a lie. There are three ABs in there. <laughs> So yeah, that is very pretty, very bright, isn't it? Lots of beautiful bright colours in there. Some confetti by the looks of it over here. Not a lot of colour blocking on this one, I would say. So yeah, this one will probably take me a while. Maybe some colour blocking in the sky. But the rest of it, I think is going to be pretty confetti heavy. And the drills for that one are there. We'll have two bags of drills for that one. But yeah, they're just lovely colours, aren't they? Really lovely colours. So that's Summertime Mill. And the next one is, again, a Dreamer Designs. <clears throat> and this one is called The Boathouse. I really like this one, it's very pretty. This one is 60 colours and it has four ABs and it is an 80 by 60. So yeah, quite a big... I don't know if you can try and slide it around so you can see the whole canvas. But yeah, again, this one looks pretty confetti heavy. <laughs> oh, yeah, look, it's uh, yeah pretty confetti heavy, that one. But yeah, and the colours for that one. Some very pretty colours in there. And this is a round drill as well, so it'd be nice to have a bit of a change with this being a large one and a confetti to have round drills. <laughs> It'd be quite nice. And the last two are from Diamond Art Club. Um, let's have a look. The first one is called A Magical View to Christmas and I believe they sold out of this one pretty quickly. But yeah, this one is a 90 by 70 and it has 64 colours in this one. And I believe either three or four, four ABs in this one, I think. So yeah, that's, it's just so pretty. But yeah, I mean, there's going to be a lot of confetti in this one as well. Look at that beautiful Christmas tree over there. How lovely does that look? But yeah, I think this one sold out pretty quick. And I don't think they restocked. They've restocked it as yet if they're going to or not. I don't know. But yeah, that one's just beautiful. As I say, 64 colours. So that's lovely. I really, really love that one. And the drills, as you can see, it is a hefty old bag of drills. But yeah, it's just some lovely, lovely colours in there. So yeah, that's my A Magical View to Christmas, which is my absolute favourite time of year. I've got some kits that I can't show you because they're, they're kits I'm working on and they're gifts for people and I don't want to at the risk of them seeing them on this video so and I've got one another one of diamond arts well I've got two diamond art studios that I'm working on that are for gifts I can't show you them unfortunately and I've got one diamond art studio kitted up um which is the one I was going to do for their purple showers event um 
but I'm probably going to end up changing my mind on that as I've changed my mind about five million times. This next one, or last one, should I say, is um, also a Diamond Art Club, and this is one I bought on a D stash group. Well, no, so I didn't actually. I won this on a quickie raffle. So basically, it was on a D stash group, and um, what they do sometimes on these D stash groups is they do um, a raffle, and you basically, there's like 25 numbers. You pick a number, pay like £2.50 or whatever for a number, and then whichever number gets picked, um, you know, they win the kit basically. And I was so shocked when I won this because I never, I never win anything. I just don't. <laughs> so yeah, I was really surprised to win this. This one is called Spirit of Flight and it is 106 by 70. And there are 66 colours in this one. A uh, couple of ABs, but yeah, I mean, I've seen this one completed and she is absolutely beautiful. But yeah, I mean, again, I can't get the whole thing in, but yeah, I've seen this completed by a creator on YouTube and it just looks absolutely stunning. It's so vibrant and pretty. So yeah, I mean, that is a, a very big kit. Not sure where, where on earth I'm going to put that on the wall, but yeah, there we go. And these are the drills for this one. Look at those beautiful colours. They're just stunning, aren't they? Absolutely glorious colours. Beautiful, beautiful drills. So yeah, that is all of my diamond paintings in my stash. Um, I will be adding some more this year, I've absolutely no doubt. Um, so yeah, thank you for joining me on my video today. Um, it's really appreciated. And if you'd be willing to follow my channel, that would also be really, really appreciated. And if there's anything you want to ask me or any comments you want to make, you know, please feel free to comment down below and um, I'll get back to you. So yeah, thank you very much for joining me today. Take care now. Goodbye.